Hi everyone and welcome to codingjust.com. Guys, in this Flutter video tutorial, I will show you how you can add a linear progress bar here uh, below your app bar or your uh, toolbar. Okay, so let's get started. And first of all, we need a variable. So we will call double web. We will name it web progress. You can name it uh, whatever you want. Web progress is equal to zero. And we will use this web progress to track our web progress or uh, web view progress. Okay, so now we need to uh, add uh, this web view to a column. Okay, so wrap this web view with a column and wrap with a column. And inside this children, we will add a size box. Okay, size sized box, and we will set the height to five. And inside the size box, we will add a child, which will be a linear progress indicator. And inside this linear progress indicator, first of all, let me add a comma here to remove the error. And inside this, we will add a value. So the value will be web progress. We will be add a color, and the color will be colors dot red i will assign a red color to our progress bar and the background color will be background colors dot black okay so okay uh, first of all we need to uh, let me cut it from here first of all we need to add a condition here and the condition will be a um, single line condition we will type web progress less than one so we will add this size box we will simply add it here and if the progress is not less than one we will simply add a empty size box okay empty size box and i will add a comma here and i will add this i will wrap this with you with a widget which is called expanded so and uh, we will track the progress inside our web view so simply uh, go to and in, go to inside our your web view widget and type on progress okay on progress and add a value here like progress progress and inside this method we will change the state set uh, set state and and uh, let me remove this comma from here or uh, i think i need to remove this semicolon and uh, okay so in this we will add this web progress is equal to progress divided by 100 okay and in a semicolon here and now if i reload this so as you can see here a progress bar here now if i click on an article so as you can see here the progress bar is visible and when the progress is finished so it will be removed from here okay now if i go back from here so as you can see here the progress bar is visible so that's how you can add a progress bar in your web view in your flutter application and that's it for this video guys and if you have any questions so you can ask me in the comment section or if you can contact me on my instagram and uh, please share this video with your friends and if you are new to my channel so make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos